Hello everyone. Today we're out at Silver Lake Park with my girlfriend. We're going that way. Remember mm -hmm. to the trails? I don't yeah. Know where we're going? Well, we're going to the trails, which are that way. <laughs> and the trail we're going to is Yeti. Oh my. This is her first day mountain biking, which is pretty impressive because we're already on a blue trail. We did all the green trails here. This is a blue trail. Don't be afraid. It's an easy blue trail. Um, but anyways. Her first day mountain biking out at Silver Lake Park, beautiful day. And I'm just kind of happy to be out. It rained yesterday a little bit, but I think that really helps firm up the trail so that, that bike's not slipping out all over the place. That's not her bike, that's my sister's old bike because she doesn't actually have a mountain bike. And that's not really a mountain bike. It just kind of has suspension, a little bit of it whatever anyways we're just gonna ride down to yeti and i'll catch you guys down there all right we're down here at yeti now ready to get going on this trail she's taking it slow her first day we're not trying to set any speed records not trying to hound or anything either because after all everyone starts somewhere But yeah, you can't even tell that it rained yesterday. It yeah, but it was nice. It's just like wetting it with a sprinkler. It just makes the trail so much better. Yeah. Blue trails typically mean a little bit more flow too but there's not much flow around here a lot of technical stuff oh my God. well if you ride the outside line then you wouldn't hit all those ruts oh, this is terrifying. Oh my God. but you're getting through it if you ever feel uncomfortable with something we can stop and walk through it and then you can try and hit it But most of the time, if you are afraid you're gonna go over the bars, just lean back a bit or push the bike out in front of you. Yeah. Then you'll be fine. Look at these roots. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go through it. Look at that. I haven't shifted either. Here's a big uphill. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah! Look at that. Right up the hill. Just stay on those brakes, lean back. Yeah, all the features kind of just go into each other a lot easier. It's not so much like turning around, going back and forth. Like a serpentine. It feels like you're actually going somewhere. Yeah, exactly. Oh. I think if you get a bike, you have to get a full suspension. Why? Because you got little legs. <laughs> I have big long legs, so I can like travel a lot. You got short little legs, so you only got a couple of inches of travel. No. All right, here we are at the very beginning of um, oh my God, what's this trail called? Barbed wire, that's it. We're at the beginning of barbed wire. Yeah, I did. Alrighty, this is the scary part. It goes really fast downhill here. You good? Was that fun? Yeah. All right, and then here comes that berm. Big berm, big berm. I don't know if I've featured this in a video yet, but they just added that in the fall. Just kind of keeps on going downhill, 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 downhill. Brakes, 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 outside. Stay on the outside of the trail.
Heavy brakes, heavy brakes. There we go. <laughs> I rode over the log. Here's another fun little part, but it's not really too much. Yeah, that was the roller coaster. This is uh, another one of those blue trails. This one's more of a technical blue. It's not so much uh, flow blue. There's a little bit of flow in it. Just heads up on those bumps there, yeah. You handle that one good. Just roll off of it. It's, it's just intimidating. Just stay on those brakes. No, I'll tell you why when we get past it. Ooh. Yeah, I'm on the brakes too. Left. So see the right part there, those logs right there? I was riding one time and the dirt came on like loose or something. And then the stick moved on me and I slipped out and I fell on my head. Wow, I think I remember you telling me about that. This is this so steep? Yeah, this is the big climb. I know, the GoPro effect. Yeah. So when you're riding through here, there's a low line and a high line. The high line is more difficult. So if you want, if you want to, you can just stay on the low side. Like the low is down there. The low goes to the left. Woo! Come on, you got it. What little things, these? Yeah, they're umbrella plants. They're still kind of coming up, but when they open up, they actually open up like a little umbrella and there's a little flower on top of them. They're cool. Oh, I almost slipped out there. Huh? Yeah, exactly. And there's a bunch of bumps underneath all these. Yeah. Is that it? Yep. And we're going to head over here to Rudy's Run to the left here. This trail is almost all downhill. I say almost. There's one downhill part, or I mean uphill part, but it's really not much. Yeah. This one's very flowy. There's loose sand around a lot of the corners, but this is a one of a kind trail here. There's no other trail like this one. You might get dizzy on this trail.
was a fun little fast part, wasn't it? Yeah. We did this trail last weekend and it was super dry like it is now. And I was further back and all the fast people were in front of me and they kicked up so much dust. <laughs> you ate their dust? Yeah, actually. Sandy landing on that jump. Here's the uphill part. It's not too steep, it's just kind of prolonged. Either way, I'm gonna go to the left. Oh, it's not a sure foot, but there's a big drop right at the edge. Last year, all year long, there was a tire mark that went right off the edge of this. Yeah. Oh, there was some, there was another one. When I was, I was riding here one time over the winter and I saw some old guy go over the edge <laughs> on his bike. I was like, you good, dude? And he's like, yeah, I'm fine. And then his buddy just kept riding because the dude fell off behind his friend. The dude didn't hear him fall because it was in the snow. And then the trail kind of circles back around and the dude saw him. He's like, hey man, I fell off that edge there. Yeah, to the left. That's, that's just KD line. Yeah. Oh, there's a jump. Hit the jump. I like that part. Yeah, it's fun. No pedaling at all yeah. until this. There was kind of a weird corner right here. Just be ready for it. This? Not this. It's that one that kind of goes up on the edge there. Oh, it's just oh. kind of sharp. You did the harder way there. I know. I couldn't see the fence at all. Last. Like all of last year, they were redoing that. Because it flooded out. Look at that. And look at where we're back to. Yep. A little wind right there. This way. We'll take the connector trail back to the car and call it a day. Okay. All right, guys. That's it for today. We rode most of the trails here at Silver Lake Park. Me and Lindsay, my girlfriend. First time ever mountain biking, how was it? It was good. It was good? Yeah. Would you go again? Yeah, 100%. Awesome. So there you have it, guys. Whoever you want to go biking with, just take them out. They might find out they really like it. So thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Mm -hmm.